So at the request of a random Reddit user, this is uh, <laughs> the solenoid system that uh, operates my pneumatic solder paste dispenser. Um, effectively, we put high pressure air in here. This solenoid pressurizes the line that pushes the goo out. And then this one opens uh, when you release the pedal in order to depressurize the line so that solder paste doesn't keep gooing, oozing out there. Um, the control circuitry is basically just a uh, pulse generator, so it's a I think a negative edge pulse generator just made out of some NAND gates or whatever um, and a bunch of MOSFETs that you know drive the, uh, the solenoids and I think that one is a uh, 5 volt regulator for the logic um, and we've got 12 volts coming in here. So if we press the button you'll hear it actuate. So that's the intake one actuating, then we will uh, listen to the release here we go, it opens for half a second or whatever, the time that it opens is fairly non-critical. Um, now to pressurise this, uh, you've got a few options. The obvious option is a compressor. This one was about 120 Australian dollars, uh, but when you switch that on, the entire block can hear it compress. It's really super loud, um, and since I have, you know, a baby upstairs and whatnot, <laughs> I went to the hardware store and made this horrible contraption here, uh, which has a Schrader valve here, so I can uh, pump that up with a normal bicycle pump. Um, this valve was basically, uh, I put it there just because when I was gluing everything together I needed to decide whether it was there, so I put it there just in case this horrible arrangement here was leaking or uh, if I wanted a different connector there or whatever, so I can uh, cut it off. <clears throat> Then a whole stack of PVC spaghetti with my highly professional gluing uh, has enough volume uh, that I can very happily do a PCB of, say, yay complexity. Um, this is a commercial board that I'll be selling soon, so I won't talk about it on Reddit, but <laughs> nonetheless, it, uh, it works a treat for what I'm doing. Um, so yeah, that's, a, that's about it. I think... Uh, if you go onto eBay, you can buy all the uh, controllers for this sort of stuff, so you certainly don't have to make this. Um, one thing I probably would recommend is buy a healthy collection of, you know, adapters, and these are, I think, 6mm out of diameter push fit connectors. They're really handy with a quarter inch BSP on the other end. Uh, I've got a bunch of these taps so that I can have, for example, a bunch of T-pieces coming off this and have maybe three or four different syringes and just switch on the one I need. So maybe one for solder paste, one for solder paste for a different size syringe and one for flux or whatever. Um, so, you know, you can never have too many pneumatic connectors. You can get, you know, these bags of five or ten T-pieces for, you know, like ten cents or whatever out of China. These things are all super cheap. Um, and it just makes, you know, playing Lego with... Uh, all the pneumatic stuff a lot easier. So hopefully that helped.